contortionist extraordinaire here, Marina. Check this out. Ouch. I'm pretty flexible for a guy. I also get regular chiropractic care, but not this flexible. Do not try this at home like her. Don't do this at home, folks, okay? Uh, she's a trained professional. She's a contortionist, right? So she is trained to do these kinds of things. Don't do these things at home. Don't try anything she's trying here at home. Don't get any bright ideas, please. Um, so a professionally trained contortionist has a team of healthcare professionals that works for her. So when she's in New York City, she comes here to Synergy Wellness in New York. But, um, you know, you'd be surprised, you know, someone like her, you'd think she's really hard to adjust. And surprisingly, she is not. Uh, she's very easy for me to adjust. She's going to do a few poses for us and just kind of show you the kind of stresses that she puts her body under. And uh, I'm going to discuss with you guys uh, a little bit about um, being double jointed. And um, that's one thing that all contortionists have in common. Uh, I've never, and by the way, we treat other contortionists here. I've never known a contortionist to not be double jointed. So if you are double jointed, uh, if you have Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, EDS, then you're going to want to watch this video because uh, EDS, uh, Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, um, gives you extra laxicity in the ligaments and tendons. We've done other videos on EDS and Ehlers-Danlos uh, and it's important that you don't stretch, that you do the opposite, that you exercise. See, she's double jointed there. But um, that's one common denominator there with all contortionists. Um, we see other contortionists, like I said, we have another video coming out, I think, this week on another contortionist. So not all contortionists do circuses or, or are in the circus du soleil. We have seen people from the circus du soleil. We've even seen people that build, built the stages for the Circus du Soleil. But, um, you know, it's important not to try these at home again. I'm going to repeat that uh, for those of you that are watching this. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and take care of some back pain, some shoulder pain she's having um, before she gets back to um, traveling again, okay? Now, again, they, uh, contortionists don't just do uh, work in the circus. Um, they work um, also in places like variety shows, teaching, schools, um, all different uh, avenues, um, mostly variety shows. And being in New York City, we have all sorts of variety of shows, although it's been quiet here in New York because of COVID. They're coming back. So let's have you turn over on your side. And we're going to go ahead and um, adjust her pelvis. And one would think, okay, well, how, how far do you have to get her joint into, uh, you know, extension there to full range of motion to adjust it? But it's real easy, as you can see here. I'm going to go ahead now and adjust the other hip. Now, her hip tilts forward on one side. Uh, it could be because of some of the maneuvers she's doing maybe she's doing some of the positions on one side more than the other uh, we try to get her to do it balanced as much as possible um, but her pelvis is out of alignment and hamstrings pulling tighter now she has a, a an old hamstring injury here that we're gonna discuss in a second um, and that affects her pelvis and the alignment of her pelvis. So uh, after this, we're gonna laser her, after the adjustment, we're gonna laser her hamstring and I'll show you how we do that. Okay, great job of relaxing. If you could turn over on your stomach. All right, hold on one sec. We're gonna laser her. She's gonna change right now. Hang tight and voila. See how fast that was? Gotta love the movies. Okay, folks, now we're gonna laser 
her hamstring. Now, this is the MR5 Active Pro laser. This is a unique laser in that it finds areas of soft tissue inflammation and damage to soft tissue. So um, not only can it find areas of inflammation, but it can also, it tells me how long to treat the area. So it's just incredible. It's an incredible tool. There are lots of great lasers out there, all different brands. Again, this is the uh, MR5 Active Pro Laser with Laser Stim by Multiradiance. Uh, we have here in the office at Synergy Wellness, um, we have five different lasers. Three of them we rent out. Um, so if you live in the tri-state area or you know within a few hours drive, you do have to come by and pick it up. But you can rent lasers and um, we've done a whole bunch of videos on lasers for all different types of conditions. Lasers are unique because they have a wide uh, wide range of applications from carpal tunnel syndrome to herniated discs to uh, neurological issues, whether it's epilepsy, occipital neuralgia, sciatica, you know, you name it. Um, soft tissue injuries, scar tissue adhesions, pre and post surgical um, adhesions and scar tissue. Um, gosh, the list goes on and on. And this laser has a wide range, so it even can help with varicose veins, although we don't advertise that and we don't deal with that uh, and use it for that reason. Uh, but, um, you know, and then obviously laser for wrinkles and things like that. Um, those are more ablative lasers. This is not an ablative laser. This is a low level laser or cold laser. Uh, it's called low level laser therapy. Deep tissue laser is another word. There's several words and names for it. They're not all equal. Really depends on the machine. And more importantly, the uh, instructor, you know, who's, who's administering the laser. Um, and uh, that's one of the most important things, who's administering the laser, making sure they're using the right frequencies, the right, uh, right dosage, all of that. Um, so right now we're focusing on pain and inflammation for her. Um, and, you know, obviously we don't have a lot of time. She travels in and out of New York. She's here, um, often she's here for a while, but this time she's just in for two days, was able to get us get in and see us today. Um, but um, if she could treat for longer, for a week or so with the laser, we could really heal that hamstring up. Figure this is going to help her heal 50% faster with cold laser therapy. Versus you know, just doing exercises or letting it heal on its own with physical therapy or um, chiropractic alone. So, you know, obviously aligning the pelvis is also very helpful, but um, the laser just helps speed this process up that much more. So uh, we're going to finish up here with the coal laser here in a few seconds. We're just going to finish scanning her hamstring. And it shows a blue light every time um, it, it finds an area of inflammation or uh, soft tissue. I'm able to shut the beeper off. I can turn it on. Right now the beeper is shut off. So I'm able to see with a blue light uh, the areas of inflammation and soft tissue damage. Okay, so now we're finishing up here the laser. Um, and there's one other adjustment here that I want to finish up with. Uh, it's a thoracic mobility adjustment. So, okay, so we're going to go ahead and put this laser back. And now what I want to do here is restore some mobility here in her thoracic spine because I noticed when she was doing one of those contortions that she was bending a lot at the lower back and the pelvic area. That's why I had her do that. So take a deep breath in. Great job of relaxing. Okay. Are you sore here? Okay. All right. So um, we did a, just a gentle adjustment there in a thoracic spine and um, 
everything moved very easy. You would think somebody that's so flexible would have a difficult, you know, it would be difficult to adjust, um, but it's the opposite, actually. People that are flexible are easy to adjust. Um, it's the people that are stiff like a board <laughs> that are difficult to adjust. So we're just doing a little Thompson technique here. This is a great, great gentle technique. Okay, Marina, we're gonna have you raise one leg at a time, keeping them straight. Okay, the other one. Okay, great, great. That looked great, they were both going up evenly. Um, you know, everything looks great here, everything feels good, except for this one anterior adjustment here, we're gonna correct in the uh in between the shoulder blades very common for people to get that so i'm gonna have you uh turn over on your back and uh, we'll adjust that thoracic area all right great cross your arms yeah, yeah you know the drill great okay so you're going to tuck your chin take a deep breath in do a half a sit up Blow all the way out and just relax yourself here. Good. All right, let's finish up here and just double check the cervical spine, the neck. I'll tell you what, these days it's not uncommon for patients to come in with subluxations in the cervical spine, just with our heads down and the computers and the laptops, our cell phones, it's very common. I think I caught your earring here. Sorry about that. Great job relaxing. Now we have another correction here on the other side. Excellent. Great job, Marina. So easy to adjust. Much easier than the really, really stiff, stiff patients that have had back or neck pain for decades, right? So thanks for keeping up with your chiropractic maintenance care. Okay, you're all set. She's gonna show us a couple of great contortions, so stay tuned, don't go away. All right, show us what you got. All right, now we're gonna do a couple of uh, split here so we can test the hamstring. Um, and how's that feel? Good, good. All right, normal range of motion. Excellent, okay. One last thing to add, always, always, always warm up before doing anything like this, uh, even stretching. Okay, folks, thank you so much for watching. If you have any comments or questions, make sure you do that below. Thank you, Marina. And thank you, YouTubers. Bye.